Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a very quick review of the Asus Strix Tactic Pro Gaming Keyboard. So on the front of the box we can see uh, some information and then a nice big picture of the keyboard. And then in the top right corner we can also see the type of mechanical switches we have, which in this case are Cherry MX Brown switches. On the side of the box, you again have the name of the keyboard and the same information, so about the mechanical switches, the macro keys, also about N-key rollover, and then the hardware mode or the software mode, um, the modes you have. On the back, there's a whole lot of information about the connector, the anti-ghosting, about the switches, the macro keys, big picture, explaining a lot of things. Inside of the box, you'll find a CD with the drivers, a quick start guide, a warranty notice, uh, four replacement keycaps for the WASD keys, and a keycap removal tool for replacing your keycaps. Then on the, on the back of the keyboard, uh, when you look at the keyboard, there's feet which pop open, which I personally don't use, and then just a very plain uh, bottom plate. The keyboard's actually quite heavy. Um, on the left side is an illuminated Strix logo and then uh, macro keys 1 to 10. On the bottom we continue with the macro keys, so with M11, M12 and M13, with, with M11 having a little reference ball thing on it. And then on the top we just have our function keys and some other macro keys. I look at the numpad, um, it's surrounded by this line there's also media keys and a very nice volume wheel there's a braided cable on the back uh which is quite thick and very nice so I've, i'm gonna end it here so very quick review um thank you for watching i'll see you again in the next video and i'm gonna end it now with a little sound clip where you can hear the keys